Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alcoholic Phoenix here and welcome to another episode of 7 Days to Die. I accidentally just ate some fucking eggs as I started to record this, so that's awesome. Oh great, how long's that last? Oh, 16 seconds, that's fine. Not a problem. Um, people have been pointing out, or at least someone mentioned in one of my comments. Oh, that's minus 10 insulation. Fuck yeah. Um, someone mentioned that in one of my Subnautica videos that I sound a little bit flat. I'm getting wisdom teeth in, and it sucks dick. Like, my mouth fucking hurts a lot. There was something that said it was untouched. What the? Oh. That was probably the trash. Okay, well, the plan is today we've got to go quickly run back into the house we were staying in and try and get a sledgehammer. Which I believe is that one there that I was staying in. If we get the sledgehammer, we'll be able to break down the metal doors much easier. Alright. And also, um, Jacob in my comment section, who's one of my friends, mentioned that that spawn of that building is pretty rare. So that's fucking baller. I'm glad to hear that. Um, I'm going to put stuff away that I don't need. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> and I'm still I'm still getting over being sick. Like, it's, it seems to be lasting forever, and it sucks a lot. I might take that just in case I want to build a campfire or something. I probably don't need so many med kits. I don't need the schematic. I should learn. I should read that. Okay. The auger parts can stay in here as well. We've got to take the sledgehammer. The eggs can fuck off because every time I have them in my inventory, I seem to accidentally eat them. Alright, so is there anything else? I might take the beer with me for Stam. And now what I want to do before it gets too dark... Well, should I take... No, I think having the sleeping bag here should be okay. It's not far to run back to the factory. That's fine. We can always get that later. Um, I would like to try and get some stone uh, to use overnight and also some wood. I think that would be advisable. Because we may possibly end up needing that stuff to do things throughout the night. So I'd like to, to get a decent little collection going of that stuff. And we've got about two hours. I believe it's an 18 hour day. And morning comes at four in the morning. Which means, yeah, we've got till 10. That's fine. Okay, so what would it take to break that? Can we break that? That's, that's very strong. I'd like to not waste all my stam. Holy shit. Swinging this sledgehammer takes a ridiculous amount of stam. Like, just an insane amount. I do have water on me. That's good. Just thought I'd double check on that. Right, I know there's stones out, like massive rocks out here, and that's what we need. I don't know how much we should get, but we probably really want to just be making axes all night if we can. Just have them crafting up so we can get over a level 100 axe minimum. Which, to be honest, in my opinion, I should have already had a level 100 plus axe. Plus, we also want to make some arrows for our bow. That would be that would be a good idea as well. Shit, my um, axe is getting pretty low, so we're just going to hit stone for the rest of it so I can easily make another one. Should have enough to make another one now. Once it breaks, yep. Alright. We'll scrap that. Axe, make another one of those. Bada boom. Coolest guys in the room. How you doing? Okay, so I'd, I'd like to know if you guys and girls are enjoying this series. It's a little bit odd for me. Because it's something that I've played for a long time. Not the greatest at, but yet... Never did a series on in the past, so it's a little bit weird to me. 
a lot of games, apart from, say, like a Call of Duty, a lot of games, when I play them on the channel, I'm more or less playing them for the first time. Something like Subnautica I'd never played before I, um, I started recording it, so... Apparently I'm low on food. Do I have anything to eat? That's not going to really help me much, is it? Not really. Not really, like, at all. Alright, let's get this last bit of stone, and then we better start to head in there. We also need to get animal hide somehow, and or leather, so we can uh, make the bellows to make the furnace. Because I think we've got pretty much everything else for that. Oh, I just want a free hand slot. Is that too much to ask? I don't want to hit the fucking stone. I want to get the damn plant fiber. There we go. Well, actually, hitting this will give us a lot, right? If we break this down. And it gives us some yucca fruit, too. Gives us three, so it's one short of giving us a, a, a nice yucca juice. Which I probably want to be able to make some of right now as well. While I'm thinking of it. Yucca juice. Yeah, let's crank out four of those bad boys. They are the good shit right there. Alright, so we want to head in to... Into the factory and see what we can do there. We also want to get arrows crafting as well. Uh, I don't know, 20 will do for now. We'll start them crafting. And we'll head into this factory and break down that door with the sledgehammer. There's going to be some zombies in there that we're going to have to clear out. If shit gets desperate, I have the gun, but I'd really prefer not to use it if I can avoid it. Alright, that's got a thousand health. That's pretty good. I mean, I guess the, there's the chance they could break through the roof. But other than that, we should be pretty good. I'll just put it in front of the door. It really doesn't matter where we put it. But we know we've got people on the other side of this. We should also crank up our gamma. So I can see and everybody else watching can see. Uh, we want to get Stam up because we're going to be fighting zombies straight away on the other side of this door. I mean, what I could do... Gives ourselves some stun immunity. And the Stam boost. Right, it's just the one guy at the moment, that's fine. Come on, die. There we go. Okay, so where's he broken through? Okay, this does lead to the outside. That's a slight concern of mine, I guess. Okay, here we go. Alright, we're inside here. What do we got? We got a locked, a locked door. Does this go to the outside? No. It looks like it goes to some lockers or something. Break down this door. Right quick. Dude, beer, beer should just be like a necessity like all the time. Holy shit, I can hear them all above me. That's super creepy. I don't like that at all. Right, pickaxe. Fuck dude, anvil's good, but not what I'm needing right now. Alright. Let's try and get away from that noise for a minute. Um, if I break down these chairs... Um... No, I kinda... Mm, well... I can break down the lead fishing weight, and then I can pick these up. This would give me leather. I can also get mechanical parts, which would be good as well. Probably more important than the nitrate powder, to be honest. So these chairs are what we want to be breaking. We want to be cracking open some of these chairs. Are there any chairs in here? Yep. 
I thought they gave me leather, because then we can get the leather from these chairs. Right, we got six. We need 20 to make the bellows. 20 of that or 20 hide. So, if we've got enough in here and we get lucky, we should have enough to make the bellows. And we will be doing really well then. Because then we can get, you know, the iron pickaxe and stuff done which will make breaking through um, a lot of these doors easy and also it will make it easy for me to get stone. Alright, now they're really pissed off. Now they're all just going to be losing their proverbial shit out there. Oh fuck, that door is severely damaged. Okay, that's not great. Where do you go to? Do you go to outside or not? I can't tell. Oh, what the fuck? Is this hole always here? No, it doesn't look like it goes to the outside, that other door. We probably should just block box this in. Just, you know, a little bit, just in case. But it looks like we can break through this door, no problems. Oh. Wait a minute. There we go. Oh, yeah. Feel the power of the sledgehammer. Alright, here we go. I kind of wish I put block durability down a little bit just so it wasn't so long to break through this because we all get the point here. We really do. Like, we all know how this all goes. This is like some culling shit with the 360 spins and wa-bang. Oh, this goes upstairs. Oh, shit. There we go. We'll just break through. And then we'll get our stem back as we as we walk. Oh, there's big holes here in the wall. Okay. Sounds like they're beating shit up up here. Possibly? No, they're under me. Yeah, they're definitely under me. There's so many parts I can get out of all these machines as well, which is glorious. Should also see if we can get anything. Like, these... these I have to, I think before the next episode I'm going to up my loot abundance a little bit because these crates are just shit. There's nothing in them. Like, I've had, I think I've probably opened at least ten of those crates and I think two of them have had stuff in them. The rest of them have had nothing. And that's just fucking silly to me. Okay. Right, we got to keep an eye on them to make sure they're not going to get in and come up and and ruin our day. Oh, oil. Not really necessary, though. Alright. Yeah, it sounds like they're coming in down low, low. Alright, where are they breaking in? Okay, they're on the other side of this. They're bashing away at that. Aha. They're bashing away at the concrete wall. Alright, no problem. Alright, that'll that'll be okay. We should be okay at least to survive the night now. I have 71 skill points to spend. I've got like so many skill points that are coming out of my butt at this point. I just don't know whether there's anything I really should put him in, although. Pummel Pete could be good if I'm using the club. Which, how much wood do I have on me? I've got a lot. What I should do is I should make a chest. Um, just put the fertilizer on the ground for a minute. And then I should put the chest down. Just wherever. In here would be fine. We'll pick that up. And then we'll put... A bunch of this stuff that we don't need right this second in the chest. We'll take that out, that out. We'll drink some of that. Um, we really don't need these. We should actually have a yucca juice. That's what we should have had. And I kind of want to make sure the lever's secure. And then what we should do is we should just make a bunch of clubs. And get that leveled up even more. 
that would be a good idea, I think. And then we can just scrap all of them bar the one. And just keep doing that. And we're going to do the same thing with axes as well. Just to get rid of everything. And we can get some really high level stuff and we'll be Gucci. But anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more, hit that sub button. Thank you all for watching. Hopefully I can live through the night. And I hope you all have a lovely day. Alright, peace.